Division Three Volleyball and Versailles looking to add to that Max State title trophy case. Last year's defending state champs finished the season ranked number one in the state for Division Three. But to get back to that championship game, they have to beat a familiar foe, Gates Mills Gilmore Academy. Tigers beat the Lancers in an epic five-set match last year for that state title. And a lot of anticipation for this rematch. Pick it up in the first set. Cross-court set comes to Lauren Bruns. The senior hammers home the kill. Then Janelle Mangan finds Bruns again. So much height on this for sales team, using it there to pick up the point. Bruns was just getting started too. Her first swing comes back over the net. So she nails the second try down for the kill. Gilmore still leading 23-17 in the first set though. So it's set point now for the Lancers. Alexa Turk gets up for the block and Gilmore gets the opening set 25-20. In the second, Versailles trying to answer. Big block from Danielle Winter and Lauren Bruns. They're pumped up. Then Mangan bumps to Lauren Monin. Good swing, and that gets down. Tigers trail 9-5. Follow that up with a quick set to Krista Putoff. And the lefty, the big spike. Seven kills for the senior in the match. Later in the second, back set from Mangan to Taylor Winner. That cuts the Lancers lead to four again, but Versailles wouldn't be able to close that gap. Gilmore takes set number two, 25-19. In the third, Winner, a kill. Eight kills for her on the night. Then some more nice play at the net as Bruns and Winner combined for the block. Tigers lead 7-6. Mangan bumps to Bruns. The senior played fantastic, finishing with 12 kills. But unfortunately, it wasn't enough. Match point for Gilmore. The serve goes into the net. The Lancers get the straight sets victory. 25-20, 25-19, 25-22. They avenged last year's loss in that state championship game. Another great season for Versailles as they make it back to the Nutter Center. And they have nothing but respect for their opponent. I think they were a great team. They, they really were. I know. I mean, they've had so many state appearances. This is almost second nature to them. And uh, I think... They played a heck of a game. I think they knew exactly where our weaknesses were, and they knew who to serve and when to serve. And it, it, they were, they were a great team all around. It just came down to who left it all out on the court, and I think we did our best, and we didn't give up at any point in this game. And I think we put everything that we had out there. I think we've grown so much from the beginning, even starting in the summer. You know, we we had a rough start, and then I think we turned into a team that I don't think anyone imagined us to be. And I couldn't be more proud of the girls that we've all became and the players that we've become and the bond that we've had now. It's indescribable. And I know we're all so proud that we've made it here. I know our community's proud we made it here. And I don't think, I mean, obviously we would love to have that gold trophy, but we got to keep our heads high.